a city with maximum number of skyscrapers, a shopper's paradise, a heaven for food lovers, a country with heavily populous regions, home to the second largest sitting Buddha statue, and of course, a pilgrimage for adventure and nature lovers. All these various attractions you can find inside a single country, which is Hong Kong. Officially known as the Special Administrative Region of the People's Republic of China, this colorful country has a lot of attractions to offer to its visitors. In this video, we are going to share a tour guide to this beautiful Southeast Asian country where we will discuss the most popular places you can visit there, what are the food that you must try there, how to go there and the approximate budget. Now, let's start our digital journey to Hong Kong for 6 days. The Visa Indian citizens don't need a visa to visit Hong Kong for up to 14 days. All you have to do is to get a pre-arrival registration to enter into the country, which you can do online. The charge for that registration is $40 approximately. Day 1 On the first day, go for the city sightseeing tour in Hong Kong. The most important places that you can cover in this tour are The Peak Tram it is one of the most popular tourist attractions of Hong Kong and you will get an unforgettable experience here. This is the fastest mode to reach at the Victoria Peak of Hong Kong. The most amazing feature of this tram route is its steep ascent of 396 meters and that's why the buildings which are passed through this route appears to be tilted at a gradient of 4 to 27 degrees making it an unbelievable illusion. Moreover, you can enjoy facilities like shopping and eating delicious food at food hubs within the tower at the Peak Galleria. Victoria Peak Located in the western region of Hong Kong, Victoria Peak is a beautiful little peak situated 552 meters above the ground. From the highest point of the peak, you can get a widespread view of the central Hong Kong, Victoria Harbour and Lama Island. The place also houses the two most popular shopping centers in Hong Kong, Peak Galleria and Peak Tower. Nong Ping Cable Car It is one of the most popular tourist attractions of Hong Kong and is a world-famous gondola lift riding which you can get a 360-degree view of the entire city. The facility is open from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and the fare is around Rs. 2000. Big Buddha Situated in Nong Ping, Tian Tan Buddha or the Big Buddha is a 34 meter tall large bronze statue of Buddha Shakyamuni and is the second largest seated Buddha statue in the world. You will have to climb 268 steps to reach this grand bronze statue. The place is open from 10 am to 5.30 pm. The entry here is free but you need to pay Rs 500 approximately to visit the exhibition hall here. Star Ferry Service this is a passenger ferry service. Availing this, you can take a tour to Victoria Harbour, Kowloon and Hong Kong Island. This is one of the 10 most exciting ferry services in the world. The service is available from 6 am to 11.30 pm. The fare is around Rs 300 per person. Sim Sha Shui Clock Tower Located on the southeastern end of Kowloon Peninsula, it is a part of the old Kowloon station from the Kowloon Canton Railways. From this tower, you can get a gorgeous view of the large green nature of Hong Kong. Avenue of Stars Built like the Hollywood Walk of Fame, the Avenue of Stars in Hong Kong is a walkway at Victoria Harbour waterfront in Sim Sa Shui. A symphony of lights It is an enthralling daily light and sound show on the Hong Kong island. Due to its brilliance, it marked its place in the Guinness World Records and is termed as the biggest permanent light and sound show across the globe. Day 2 On the second day, go to visit the Disneyland in Hong Kong. It is a whole day long trip. The Disneyland is the largest theme park in Hong Kong and the second largest Disneyland in Asia. It is often referred as the happiest place on this planet. The park is divided into 9 themed areas. Other than the thrilling rides, you can enjoy here terrific live shows, Disney characters parade, guided tours and magical events. 
The place is open from 10:30 a.m. to 8 p.m. and the entry fee is around rupees 5,900 per person. Day three. On the third day, visit Ocean Park. Located in the Ong Chu Khang, Ocean Park is a marine mammal park, oceanarium, animal theme park, and amusement park all in one place. It is the second largest theme park in Hong Kong and is divided into two areas: the summit and the waterfront. The two are interconnected by a 1.5 km long cable car system and the Ocean Express funicular railway. The summit and the waterfront areas are further subdivided into a total of eight zones. You can avail many rides, activities, games, and even shows here. The place is open from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. and the entry fee here is around rupees 4,000 per person. It will take around five to six hours to complete this theme park tour. Day four. On the fourth day, go to Macau from Hong Kong. An hour-long ferry ride will take you to Macau from Hong Kong. Macau is located in southern China and is the most densely populated region in the world. Here you can be entertained with world-class luxury. The place is a fusion of east and west in all aspects. Day five. On the fifth day, go for Macau city tour. The major tourist attractions here are Saint Paul's Ruin. Saint Paul's ruins are the ruins of a 17th century Catholic church complex. Here you can witness a front granite facade. And grand stone staircase of 68 steps. It is located adjacent to the famous Mount Fortress and Macau Museum. It is one of the seven wonders of Portuguese origin in the world and is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The place is open from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Ah Ma Temple. It is the oldest temple in Macau dedicated to Chinese goddess of sea Mazu. It is believed that the name Macau City is derived from this temple. The temple is open from 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. Senado Square. Senado Square is a paved public place where you can enjoy various activities and shopping. The triangular-shaped square is a part of the historic center of Macau and is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Day six. On the sixth day, head back to the airport for departure. The budget and the food. Hong Kong is a paradise for every food lover. Here you can have a wide range of delicious street food. Some of the popular street food items here are egg tarts, fish balls, egg waffles, and stinky tofu. Other than this, do try the famous dumplings and wonton soup while you are in Hong Kong. Almost all major tour operators in India provide Hong Kong tour package. A typical package includes accommodation, food, sightseeing tour, and local transfer. This package will cost around rupees thirty-five thousand per person, excluding flight fare and the entry tickets to the parks. You can book the package and theme park tickets online. I will share the links in the description box below. But please remember, the rates may vary due to some unavoidable reasons. If you love this tour plan, then please like and share the video. Also, do let us know your opinion in the comment section below. Your opinion means a lot to us. Thanks for watching it.